la auto ni la mi le mau peni ya wen a a o vi buni tatana nzanye ke la auto ni la mi my grandfather told me that he, when he was uh, come here was the main space of animals. In the early 1970s, Mozambique was rich with wildlife. From 1977 to 1992, Mozambique suffered through a devastating civil war. Nearly one million people died, many from famine. Almost all of the country's animals were killed, eaten by opposing armies and a starving people. Zanav National Park was created in 1972 before the Civil War broke out. Zanav's ecosystem was thrown into chaos by the loss of so many animals. Now, this park is being restored with a new concept in conservation known as rewilding. The park, co-managed by the Mozambique government and Peace Parks Foundation, is bringing back Africa's most iconic species. These charismatic creatures attract tourists, which could help rebuild Mozambique's economy. Tourists like to see uh, different animals out there. But there is no point in bringing animals back to Zanav if they are not safe. A well-trained team of anti-poaching rangers is a crucial first step. Esteval commands this ranger outpost. I'm protector of this nature. I'm protector of this enough. He and his team run daily patrols on foot and on bicycles. They are protecting all the animals in Zanav, including ones recently reintroduced to the park. But Zanav will never be the same without elephants. A keystone species, elephants are critical to the health of an ecosystem. They disperse seeds through their dung. Their massive presence paves highways for other species. The Zanav ecosystem needs elephants, but it's not easy to find elephants to import, especially as poachers are killing nearly 40,000 across all of Africa each year. Fortunately, De Beers Group's Venetia Limpopo Nature Reserve, 1,000 miles away in South Africa, has a solution. It has too many elephants. We're so happy because now we are receiving elephant. A long days ago, we had not elephant here in this park. Now we are seeing elephant in life, so we are so happy. But how do you actually move 200 living creatures, weighing more than 2 million pounds, 1,000 miles? This is Moving Giants.